Hey folks, here at osmvtxreads.com, we're watching our video unboxing of the Sidewinder Emergency Cell Phone Charger. In addition to being an emergency charger, it's a very green charger, which allows you to connect your phone into the device via a standard mini pin connector, and then allows you to crank up the sides of this mini generator, and then power up your phone. As long as your phone isn't completely dead and out of juice, you will be able to use this device. And it, uh, the company states that about six, uh, five to six minutes of turning will allow you to extend your battery life by around 10 minutes, depending on what type of phone you use. Of of course, if you have a super smartphone with a lot of uh, wireless options like Wi-Fi and GPS and 4G, that will obviously be a little bit shorter. Still, it provides a nice way uh, for you to crank up your ba uh, battery on the go, on the trip. It's a nice conversation starter and also great to have in the car or perhaps in your pockets and jeans. Now, compared to solar panel chargers, which are also another option for energy green and uh, interesting chargers out there, solar panels uh, are, tend to cost a little bit more in terms of production, so those chargers will actually run you about $20 more. This particular Sidewinder will also cost around $30 in stores, which is a lot more inexpensive than most retail green uh, chargers that you might find in stores. Taking a look at the packaging, it says this device is only suitable for the Sony Ericsson models, however this is not true, like we stated. As long as you have adapter tips for you to plug into the Sidewinder and the other head into your phone, this will uh, essentially work with almost any phone out there, as long as you have the adapters, which can be purchased separately on ebay.com for about $2 each, so it will work with the host of devices. The testing um, begins with you know how effective of a charger the device is, and whether or not it's actually going to work very well or not. So crank up the batteries, no batteries are included, uh, are needed. There's also a bonus LED light on this particular unit, so you can actually use it as a uh, night light if you want to use it for that. And some more information, you know, it supports whatever models, uh, how to turn it, and then it's going to, you know, give you uh, how much power. So if we open up the packaging for this particular device, and take it out, some particular models of the Sidewinder also includes a built-in little case which for you to protect your device in. However, this more cost-effective version that we have here actually does not include the case. The case bundled version will be sold at selective locations such as Amazon.com for an extra $5, and if you're looking for something to protect your charger in, then perhaps that's a better iteration to purchase. Otherwise, the generator itself is completely the same. This is, uh, again, environmentally safe, very small, very tiny, and it's also voltage regulated so it won't overcharge your phone when you plug it into your unit. So it's uh, some benefits of the Sidewinder. Again, the packaging here is very tedious and difficult to open, it seems. Hopefully that will do the trick. And I'll cut my hand in the process. Let's try and somewhat destroy the packaging there. I'm just going to grab out the unit. It looks like there's a lanyard cord attached to the model, so you have a free lanyard. And the charger tip is actually on the inside here, and there's actually nothing stuck in the paper, I believe, so there is no instruction manual. It's fairly uh, complimentary and uh, easy to use. Nothing really needed, just to turn the sides, and then you'll have power. So again, the unit itself is semi-transparent. It's actually quite hefty, so it uh, weighs a little bit as well. And you can see the side actually is flips out like so, and then you can twist it just like um, those twistable um, flash lights for you to generate your own power. And um, the gel is actually pretty easy to actually turn, so it's not too hard. It's very small, very pocketable, definitely. The lanyard is pretty good quality, and the light is on the very top. And this is actually the power cord for you to plug in your phone into this port, and then again plug it into your device to actually charge. So of course we're going to test this in the labs. Um, it doesn't look like there's an on-off button at all, so you basically just turn it. It doesn't store any battery, unlike some solar panels, so it just has the instant battery that it actually uses, instead of having something you can store and then turn off and use for later usages, which is probably why Sidewinder could actually price the device so competitively and so low. Anyways, this is the first look. We're going to cut back with a full review of the Sidewinder. So, uh, Sidewinder Charger, so you can learn more on their website, osmvtxreviews.com. This has been our unboxing first look. Thanks for watching here at OS and VTX Reviews.